in Santa Clara for the college football playoff national championship game. As we'll see the Texas Tech Red Raiders taking on the LSU Tigers. One game to decide it all. It's the college football playoff national championship, and off we go from Levi's Stadium. This fielded at the two. And it's a pretty good return here as he'll get it up to the 29-yard line. With one game of college experience now in his pocket, this young quarterback leads the Tigers up first and 10. They'll try and start this drive in the air. And incomplete to open things up. Isaiah Street's the intended target, but it'll be second down. The Tigers of LSU looking for their fourth title in school history. They were champs way back in 1958 and twice in this century so far, 2003 and 2007. We got three, fellas. We got three. I get this Back to throw now on second and ten. Goes back to streets. This time he's got it. And he'll be tackled right on the chalk at a 45. And this thing 16 yards hard. a first down. Like, LSU with a first and ten. I got to do slants all day, man. He'll drop to throw. Flush to his right. Like, they got my big trade. to streets. And he takes this one down almost like, all the way to the like, 30. Call that a very strong gain of 24. So on the other side of the field no, now, it's first so and 10. As they've got things rolling on this drive. Flushed out right. Look, what the His world? Like, bro, complete. like a dual flat. And look how you throw the ball, man. Had an open man that time, but ended up putting a little too much heat on it, don't you think, partner? Absolutely, just needed Absolutely. a touch more air on it instead he fired an absolute bullet. They want me to score four touches. Wow, I told, I told y'all he was going to get set. Talking about score four touches. Score four touches. Like that, man. Now, now they're looking at a third and long and suddenly. I put the thing on rookie show up and score four touches. But I'm not damn on real. I can't do that all, man. Look, man. Now on third down, that pass knocked down in the backfield and incomplete. There is no denying they want to get him involved. That's already the fifth time that they've looked his way in this first quarter. So that tells me defensively no, that they want to insist on going in that direction. Make sure you get your best down. people Pull in the down, area man. to try and take that away. Oh, no. That is caught. Uh, He's got streets. And they'll have it in the red zone before he crosses over out of bounds. A fourth down. No now nervous too, 19 man. yards that time. But now it's first and ten. They'll set up to throw. That's a play that Isaiah oh, Streets made. He will I'll take this in. But I thought I was going to LSU. So the boy might get a home run on the first one. Away. And LSU has taken the early lead. Man, 20 is real hard. I'm not going to stand. Partner, they can all agree that that was a pretty dark go opening 19. drive right there. And the key to it all, going for it on fourth down earlier in the drive. Set a tone for it. And the best part, they made it pay off. That's fielded in the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, right, so and it comes out to the 25-yard line. Now watch this. Evo about to light me up. But I'm going to do that. It's going to be a boring game, whoever watching this on YouTube. Because I'm going to be doing the sound. Slant, so I'll be the dick boy. As he'll be hit and taken down And I the hope backfield. I get a touchdown quarter. A loss of a yard there to start out. That leads to a second and 11. Oh, oh screen. Pass it. Wow. They go screen. No, it's man. complete. Wow. And this on rookie, y'all. And he's able to get out to the 32, brought down there. It'll be a pickup of eight on the screen. And yes, I do play on Madden, but do my first time by Madden. But they were dead, man. On third I'm down. To Look, and this on rookie, y'all. And they'll get it up just short of the 45 at the 44. They give him 12 yards and a first down. Plenty of things to talk about here, partner, but to me, their defense gave up a touchdown on the first drive. How about how they're responding, coming back? That's a big third down pickup to keep their drive alive. Man, here's the NFL. Look, the dude just... I barely can 
Bell could transition. Texas Tech, okay. a newcomer to the college football playoff. They have won 11 conference titles in their history. But boy, this would be quite a feat but like, to make I'd a run through these games YouTube. in Dallas and, and Santa Clara. Going. Six touchdowns, fumbling, and in the cell shoes. Talking about they've been all made. It'll be a loss I'm of playing on rookie. And, and I'm struggling. And I know I'm not this. I like the strategy. You know. Extra tight ends, extra beef. They want to run the football. That means you probably want to run it inside. If you get strung out on the perimeter, you're a hero. Yeah, we saw the result. Negative yardage. Throwing there, but this is going to wind train. up incomplete. Like normally on rookie, every time you play training, you get in the third long on your own side of the field. Just couldn't come up with anything. That's why teams always talk about having to win the early downs, meaning you've got to gain yardage and set yourself up for third and short. I'm because me. when it's third and long, the odds go down significantly trying to pick up the first down, even throwing the football. Oh, I finally got the truck. Nice <laughs> job bringing that one back. 14 on the return. And that will come the offense as they take over. over. Oh, the Tiger street. offense sure. ready to get after it one more time. And coming up on their second drive of the game, had the touchdown last time out. Now they have the football back. Chance to really seize early momentum. Feels to me like they had a really excellent week See, of practice. Dude, they were all coming together. On. But I'll bet you got galvanized in the locker room in pregame. Somehow I think the head coach is on a total skills round point. All game long. From the the in now, here's first and ten. He'll look to throw. Look, man, this throw's like, gonna like, be incomplete. And that's one he's gotta be happy to have back. There wasn't a hole open in the zone. You'd have to think on early downs like that first down there, need to be a little bit more careful. Yeah, fortunately for him, got a couple more downs to play with. Got it. Here's a ball thrown right side. I forgot they got a uh, half on one feet in the end of the right ball. 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 I keep thinking too. It's a pick up of 17 and a first but down. But sorry that this game is boring because like, I really do want to do like help mirrors and stuff. But every time I do a help mirror. The midfield strike they look to throw. Every time I do a mirror. Escape and he goes down. I throw an interception. Following the sack, they'll look to make amends on a second down and 17. After one, 7 0 on EA Sports. 7 0 on EA Sports. They're going to look to throw. Look, man, they got my team terrible. Incomplete. Like, if I go. Alright, I'm going to do every like this game. Defense has been able to Play do with the Cowboys. Yeah, they get the sack on first down, then they throw every down. incomplete pass. Now they're just a play away from getting the football right back. But it's oh, a big play. Yeah. They've got to hold up. Quick slam caught by Streets. They wind up getting 16, but even that's not quite enough. It's fourth down. Man. Now they'll throw here out of the gun. I don't even know how to slide, to be honest. Taking matters into his time. own hands, and he picks up the yards in the first down. Down. We've seen the pressure get to him several times in this game. There, though, we see him escaping. And we've seen this rookie it's... video before as well. That type of pressure, oftentimes, what do you resort to? Your legs trying to escape. What you hope is that this doesn't become habit for him, that he learns how to handle the pressure, still keep oh. his eyes downfield, and make some throws. 36 yards on the play. Down, <laughs> Here's a first and goal, oh, go. LSU. From the shotgun, he'll look to throw. And that is caught. I got two and two more to go. Like, like I told y'all, I might need a touchdown every, every quarter. Touchdown here in this first half. And LSU adds on to their advantage. Uh, I'm recording. Point after, right down the middle. And it's now 14 to nothing. After the touchdown, the LSU Tigers kick team out there to send this one away. This is fielded a couple yards deep. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. The Red Raider offense set to take over here. Already down two touchdowns here in the first half. This becomes a pretty important drive, doesn't it? It certainly does, and a lot of the teams script plays. We know that, right? They, they have a script to start the ball game, and typically those scripts go between 12 and 24, 25 plays. Down two touchdowns early, 
probably not very deep into their script. I think that they'll stay with it. I don't think they'll abandon it just yet and try and generate some offense on this drive. Anything, at least three points get that zero off the board. Throwing again on second down, but this time it's incomplete. It's a lot of contact going on there, and in the end, unable to keep two hands on the football and bring it into his body. Everything looked pretty good until the finish. So the failure to connect on second down, that leaves him staring up here at a third and eight. Now Warren. He's going to find his running back. It's complete. And he's going to come up a bit short. He needed to get to the 35 for the first, but he only makes it to the 34. A short game that doesn't get him the first down brings up a fourth down situation. Really nice job defensively. They knew where the sticks were. They got the stop before it. A good return there, call it 13 yards. And possession will switch hands, first and 10. The Tiger offense ready to get after it one more time. But Charles, we talked in the semifinal about Isaiah Street's brother, Ezekiel, lost due to leukemia exactly one year ago today. But since then, Isaiah's been active in trying to help those who are going through the same struggles his brother went through. He formed a real bond, in fact, over the summer with one of them, 11-year-old cancer patient, Emily Atwood. Uh, sorry about that, y'all. That my grandma, y'all. And we're told so, that Emily uh, and her father Todd made the two-hour drive up to Arlington a week ago to right, watch so their semi trying to oh, and nice block, some time yeah, afterwards nice good throw. and his new Ooh. quarterback. And folks so, out there, you see know. Isaiah's face lights up and the discussion turns to the young lady. He calls him and the inspiration he takes from her fight. So sorry for really doing something play over normal, to but say. I'm a record from the locker room and show you every game and he says, listen now. I know my dude is not accomplished, not that good, not a, um, heck of a, um, man who wants to get back. not pass my own boy, it, but, you know, not that good, you know. Gets it. He's Emily in so-called college right now, room, a surgery and my dude is grounded, that shit probably why I'm not ready to do that, because he and of course we're thinking of her as well and wish you know, but I gotta do the time set over and over but once I get the full touchdown once I get the full touchdown well, I'm gonna throw like four interceptions just to prove to y'all that just to prove to y'all back to throw here all the prognosticators have a first round uh, grade on Isaiah Street should he decide to jump to the NFL after this season but all indications are that he wants so to like come I'm gonna back do it, like come out. I don't know who I'm going to do it. I might even do it with you. I don't know if Enoch is still on this. I'm going to throw it with the worst down down quarterback on here. Well, I don't want to bash you like that, but I'm going to show y'all what a bad quarterback can do. Throw it better than my dude. Ooh, that boy got hit. And they do get him down, but not before he's able to slip it inside oh, the five-yard line. Oh, yeah. A good pick up there of 20 yards. They'll look to throw. Interception. And it's intercepted at the goal line. J6. Able to get there and pick it. Come on, Street. He's at the 50. Wow. 30. Wow. This is wow. And he will have a touchdown. You think you're going into halftime with a good size lead? Not so fast. That pick six really changes the complexion. Probably also changes drop the down my dress stop. No doubt about it. Instead of going in relaxed, you're probably a little more uptight right now. Probably a little bit angry. Add me on Snapchat at Austin 1995. You will. So they'll get another shot. You want a shout out? Be like, hey, I subscribe to the channel. Away. Send me a screenshot. And I get over 3,000 to 5,000 views. I mean, yeah, views on Snapchat. And, and I will shot you out. Subscribe. Like, comment. Arthur 1995, if you will. You know. So now, why do you Why do you Now, why do you Yeah, you got the lead. It's a, definitely a thought. See? Let's go ahead and try and increase it. I play like a normal. At the same time, I don't like the odds. I don't like where they Get like a normal game, boom. Done well in the first half. Kid. Don't mess it up and go into halftime looking at each other wondering what if. Open man here, Streets. And they're able to get this one across the 35. Give him 14 doing no hard on that one. one and a first down. LSU with a first and 10. Early one to score three touchdowns. Looking to throw. And they kicking this dude. Interception. 
Oh, no. He's got another hook up here with Streets. Now the offense going to use the first of their timeouts as it'll come with 15 seconds to play okay, in the I'm first half. Come. So they move from one right, foot to the other as they come up on first down. First down. The play action fake. They'll look to throw. Oh, he's going to let this go for the end zone. And that is caught. It's an LSU touchdown. First time they ever had. Right, yeah. Isaiah Streets in the final seconds of the first half. And LSU adds on to their advantage. And that's a lead that excites a team as they head into the half. Good way to finish things off. Yeah, able to extend that lead, and you always say it, that can totally change the complexion of half number two. Yeah, it changes your morale, changes your outlook, but even before that, let's see if they decide to kind of squib kick or what they're going to do on the kickoff, because you don't want to give up a big play right before the half ends. Good point. My mother in law blowing up her phone. I mean, they see her calling her. <laughs> I mean, she calling her. She on the phone with her sister. Oh, what's up, Mama? Yeah, this is a great finish. Yeah. Yeah. Then off to the locker room, and they're going to have some adjustments to make. They certainly will, and I think a lot of people think going to be it. Take the knee, get out of here, regroup. But how will the head coach and his staff approach halftime? Will it be angry? Will it be clinical? Will it be calm? Will they just let it all out? Who knows? I'm a bit fly on the wall for this one, though. Why is she trying to call me through Facebook? Hi, y'all, Michael. Hey. Hmm. All right. Did, did, I'm all. Play better in the second half. All right? What? Play better? What? Just give me the ball, all right? Oh, let me do Lord. my thing. Don't do that. I'm arguing with him. I'm about to get my hair braided up soon. In two weeks. You got all the touchdowns. Okay on every play? Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm sure the defense is going to figure that out. Okay, back. well, you need to figure it out. This Give isn't just them a game that money back, and I want my car. I know that. I know <laughs> that, Isaiah. It's still here. It's still here. Oh, I thought you yeah. sold it. So what? Just one half remains in the college football season as we begin the second half of this national championship game. And a short kick, taking it about the 16. And a nice return sets him up pretty good here at the 30-yard line. The Red Raider offense set to take over here. They have the ball here for the inaugural drive of the second half. Pretty big deficit, though. We'll see what adjustments were made in that locker room. And I never want to make something more important than it actually is, right? I don't want to create more hype than what is there. But this is a do that? I'm doing it, though. <laughs> this is a really important drive. And we often talk about teams scripting plays to start a game. A lot of them script to start the second half, too. And they're scripting something that they expect to get them into the end zone and back into this game. We'll see if that script is a good one for them. Another throw on second down, and this one incomplete as well. This offense in desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. From the gun, Warren, nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Man, he got in there so quickly, Charles. What could the offense have done to adjust and account for that? But what you're hoping is that you figure out and you see and get a clue that maybe there's going to be some pressure coming at you. And you change the blocking schemes. Maybe you go to max protection. The biggest one is maybe you bring your running back in to try and keep you clean. But in that case, that didn't happen. Zero accountability and a sack resulted. Give him 11 yards that time on the return. And the offense will take over with a new set of downs. Ball up to the 35 now as they come up on first and 10. A good start to the drive here. That's caught out on the left side. And they're going to have this across midfield and inside the 45. A well-executed 22-yard gain. Back to throw now on first down. Sideline throw hauled in by Streets. 15 yards through the air and a first down. 
His big game continues. Already has the three touchdown grabs, tacking on some more yardage and a first down. And how precise has his route running been in this game? We just saw him get open yet again. He's also made adjustments as the defense has tried to really stop him. Escaping the pressure right. That's going to be caught. A really good pickup of 28 yards. If you were with us for the semifinal, we told the story. I mean, this is a quarterback who was heavily recruited out of high school four years ago on signing day. Had all the hats in front of him. People weren't sure where he was going to go. So many different offers. And that is caught. It's an LSU touchdown. Isaiah Streets. There to right, make the grab. Uh, uh, and LSU uh, adds uh, on to their seven, advantage. 14, 14. Yeah. There you go, Charles. Apparently all she had to do was ask. How about that? His fourth touchdown pass yep. in this championship well, well. game. So now I'm about to run this ball. Give him That's credit crazy. for living up to it. And I bet they're both relieved that there won't hey, be baby. another game. She might ask for eight touchdown yeah, passes this is the 18, y'all. After the, the touchdown, 18. the LSU Tigers kick team yeah, out there to send this up. one away. Why my grandma This is feeling a couple yards deep. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. She had a scary dream. The Texas Tech offense about ready to go here for their next possession. These guys had a punt last time. It has not been a very fruitful game offensively thus far. They haven't even made a trip to the red zone. And I know that everyone's going crazy on that sideline because that drives you berserk to come off the field, not really move the ball well. As you said, not even get to the red zone, let alone, you know, not even put points on the board. They've got to just take a deep breath, relax, try to figure out what is working, and call more of that. Now a nice throw here right side. He hauls it in and brought down, but not before reaching the 45-yard line. 15 yards on the play, first down. First and 10 now for Texas Tech. Here's Warren to throw. Now they set up the screen, that's complete. And this will leave him a yard short. Nice pickup of nine yards on first down. For a second there, I thought that might break big. Screen pass, looked like it was coming together, looked like there was an opening. Still, ended up with a solid game. And he gets it inside the 35 and just shy of the 30. I think they like this drive a little bit better there, partner. Running game helping out, picking up some of the slack. Because remember the last drive, they went three and out. Line of scrimmage, the 31 now on first and 10. On the ground, they go with Young. And he's going to get this down near the 20-yard line. It's a 10-yard pickup, and it moves the chains. Despite the score, despite the deficit, no quitting this guy. He's running angry, running through arm tackles. He wants to change what that scoreboard is saying. Throwing on first down. Warren, this is caught. And he will get this into the end zone for a Red Raider touchdown. This shit real, man. This thing real. And his guys are able to close that gap just a bit. I think if you pulled defensive backs, they would say the corner route, take that out, make it illegal, because that is so hard to recognize and so hard to adjust because your first move is to not get beat in the middle of the field. And that's how they move you first before they break off to the corner. But then as the wide receiver, great job. It's tough to turn those upfield and go, but he did a great job with it there. Really good balance, really good body control. And how about the end result? A touchdown. The Tiger offense ready to get after it one more time. They've got to like their position. They lead this championship game, two quarters to play. What's the course of action in the second half? I think you continue to show your quarterback that you've got faith in him. Continue to run the offense the way you did in the first half. Continue to give him opportunities. But behind his back, head coach is telling the offensive play caller, if you see any moments where it feels too big for him, be ready to dial this game plan back. It'll be a pickup of five on the keeper. It's second down. They're trying to show that they can run the ball, protect this lead, give it to the backs, play a little bit of keep away, don't you think? And that's probably a good philosophy at this point, going to make that defense stand up and stop them. Second and five. Over the middle, it's Isaiah Streets. 
And they're well past midfield, just a yard or two shy of the 40. A gain of 13, it's a first down. So on the other side of the field now, it's first and 10 as they've got things rolling on this drive. And he's going to get it down to the 33-yard line here. Give him 10 yards on the keeper, and it'll lead to a second down. They still need about the length of the football here, maybe a little less as they come up on second and inches. Back now here on EA Sports. As we've got the final quarter upon us, we get ready to start the board. And he fumbled it. It's on the ground. On plays like this where the ball comes free, it's often unusual for the team that lost it to get it back because this is, this is a quarterback. The ball gets away from him. Everyone else is trying to execute what they're supposed to do on offense. They're usually looking in the other direction, downfield, or have moved away from him. In this case, though, a teammate is able to come up with the ball. Second and 15. This one complete to Streets. And they'll get this one to about the 20-yard line. It's a pickup of 17 and a first down. Another nice pick up through the air, and I think a lot of people might expect them to run the ball in this situation, Brandon, but with this lead, they're electing to throw the football. Swing, slant, quick out. And intercepted, maybe the turning point they need. Picked off inside the 10. First week of the preseason, probably not the pass, the impression that the rookie wants to leave right there. Yeah, no probably about it, because that's not what you want to do to try and press your new coaching staff, try to impress your locker room, and most importantly, yourself. Probably spent all night last night saying, don't throw an interception early. Make sure you take care of the football. But now he's got it out of the way. Hopefully he can just settle in and move on. Now he'll look to throw here on second and 10. And it's a short one here, complete to the tight end. And able to get it here to about the 16-yard line. Only three yards on the catch. It's third down. You got the big lead defensively. Willing to give him that underneath stuff, right? And this is why you work on your tackle. Tackle him after the catch, inbounds, keep the clock running. Just go ahead and lead the game out that way. Over the middle, complete. That's Simmons. And he'll be corralled well upfield right around the 40-yard line. 23 yards on the play. The Red Raiders with a first and 10. Looking to throw. Warren. He'll try and set up the screen. It's complete. And this play will be blown up. He'll lose yardage back at the 38. This will be a two-yard loss on the play. And that'll make it second and 12. Second and 12 after the first down pass play went backwards for two yards. Trying to run inside, but nothing there. No gain that time, and it leaves him with third and 11 coming up. The offense on third down today, two for five to this point. This is third and 11. Operating from the gun. Warren throwing right, and that's complete. And he takes it into the end zone. Touchdown, Texas Tech. So that's a really big play here in the fourth quarter. And don't look now. They're right back in this game. Did it feel to you, as it did to me, that maybe they were a little bit soft in what they were lining up with on defense? Almost like they were protecting the lead rather than trying to make a play. And now that lead is down to just one score. This is taken at the three. And not a bad return here. He gets it out to the 25-yard line. The Tiger offense ready to get after it one more time. I'm curious to see, Charles, about the play calling on this drive. Last time out, the interception that led to a touchdown. Here we are. I mean, it's very close. One score game. Yeah, and if I'm a defender, I'm actually chirping Chile on the other side of the ball. said, hey! We picked off the last one. What you gonna do about it now? So when you do throw the football, high percentage, but throw with confidence. If there's any hesitancy at all, it could end up in enemy's hands again. Now the defense gonna use the first of their timeouts as they'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. An ideal down and distance to try to finish this thing off. Second and inches. And they'll get this one down to about the 20 yard line. Now a second timeout called for by the defense. 
And they'll be disappointed to have to burn one there after giving up the first down. Now a fake on the give here as they try the run pass option. Oh no, he lost the football. Now the defense will burn their third and final timeout as they'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. So they come up on second down and they can get another run like we just saw. they will likely put an end to this thing. And now they're inside the 10 as he's brought down at the nine. Four yards on the play and that leads to the first and goal. Here's a first and goal LSU. Here they go with Livingston. And this carry not as productive. He swallowed up at the line of scrimmage. They'll say no gain on the play, and it'll be second and goal. Here's second and eight. Steps away to his left. And, he, and he's across for the touchdown. And in the final minute, that should just about seal it. I'm pretty sure that that was a passing play, but he took off pretty quickly and ran with it. Love his decisiveness on it because you're exactly right. He was supposed to go back in the pocket and survey the field and throw the football. But when that hole opened, he just said, forget it, let's go. And boy, did that work out well. After the touchdown, the LSU Tigers kick team out there to send this one away. This is taken about seven yards deep. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. The Red Raider offense set to take over here, and they're hoping to redo their efforts in the last drive when they got into the end zone. And just think of what it's like now on the sideline, because when you score a touchdown, you have to go over and look at the tablet. And this is intercepted, and that should do it. Picked off at the 39. That time defensively looked like they showed quite a bit of pressure, but backed off, and it proved fruitful. They get the pick. He went through all of his rules about getting rid of the ball quickly because he read blitz. He saw all those people stacked at the line of scrimmage, and then they fooled him by dropping into coverage. Now he's ready to get rid of the ball fast, but guess what? Too many defenders out there, exactly as you described, an interception. Right after the turnover, they come out throwing. And that means it's a sudden change situation. We used to practice it on defense. Sudden change, get out there, stop the offense. But you typically run out there a little bit unsettled. I think that's why he came right out throwing the football, hoping to catch him on balance. And he did. Now the offense going to use the first of their timeouts. And as the two teams talk it over on their respective sidelines, we take a break. And he'll get him inside the 15 down to the 14-yard line. Now another timeout called for by the offense. That'll leave them with just one remaining in this fourth quarter of play. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. That one looks like he'll throw here. And it's caught. And he will take this in. Touchdown, LSU. A 14-yard touchdown. And LSU adds on to their advantage. And to me, that touchdown allows you to start grinning widely on your sideline. I think they pretty much locked this one away. Yeah, that's the clencher, the proverbial icing on the cake, if you will. Now he's back out there to boom this one away, maybe with some frustration after the PAT miss. This is taken about seven yards deep. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. The Texas Tech offense about ready to go here for their next possession. They're down big here late. I don't know. You just one last drive here for pride. Some people like to do that. I remember playing for a guy once we were down huge. It's almost a like, coach, what do you want to call? He just waved a hand like, who cares? Let's Make get out of here and do something some <laughs> other time. But some teams like to do something at the end to feel a little bit better yeah. as, they continue to, as they continue to move forward. Yeah, probably just want to put this one behind them. Warren going to pass it. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. That throw good for four. It's second down. Second and six. Got his man complete over the middle. It's Simmons. We blow these boys out. Um, so, uh, I hold my stat line. Story but, behind a quarterback um, who had never taken a snap in a college I think I football just game until man. nine days but, ago. Uh, they are the national champions. Yeah. All right, uh, I'm not going to stop, but I'm just turning up the mic. Ladies and gentlemen, 
Oh, it's my turn your attention to the podium oh, at midfield I for the be presentation be of the college football playoff national championship right, trophy as we present your college football national champion, the LSU Tigers. Hey, LSU. Jack Ford. Talk about a long shot. And as a man who's known as the quarterback whisperer, and I suggest you trademark that, by the way, um, how are you feeling about your quarterback right now? Yeah, yeah. I tell you, this kid's amazing. Oh, I thought you were gonna say I saw. He worked around the clock to prepare for this game. I never seen anything like it. And I am so proud of what he's done. And under this kind of pressure, well, all you NFL that, yeah. scouts out there are paying attention. Well, I did play. I threw this kid's I special. I ran for one. Come on, man. You deserve it, son. Congratulations. Yeah. Coach, this is you, man. This is great. Thank you. A perfect yeah. end to a too short season. Yeah. You're two leaving games. here play as two champion. Games. I, 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 it's better than I ever thought it would feel. In the living room. I can't even describe it, really. It's just to be up on the stage, celebrating with these guys. It's perfect. It's just perfect. It is a perfect end, but it seems like you put up a pretty good case that it shouldn't be today. How do you feel about that? I, hey, I, I think I gave myself a shot. If the NFL comes calling, I'll pick up the phone. 2K20. But this guy over here, this guy, yeah. take that trophy, man. Absolutely. Yeah, he scored for Isaiah touchdown. Streets. Me and him got into it on the We side. are all aware of the loss of your brother. Yeah. And what it took to he be lost here today. And, uh, but can you tell us cool. in this moment yeah. how you're feeling right now? Cool. Well, girl, it's a lot, yeah. lots of feelings, yeah. Taylor. Uh, his brother lost. I made a promise to my brother that I was going to. <laughs> you know, none of this, none of this would have been possible without this man right here. Hey, this dude came in into an impossible you situation. You here? He's got heart. Love you, man. Hey, I love you, man. <sighs> See? This was for you, baby. Yeah. This was for you. Yeah. Let's go. A lot of emotions out on the field tonight. This is what football is all about. About getting hit and getting back up. And as you can see in a season that was characterized by overcoming, these guys did just that and won a national championship. Back to you guys.